Good morning. Six o'clock. Daylight savings time. We are here again, trying to catch our first morning walleye. There's a bridge. So I did get a lot of good tips, tricks from people from previous videos that we did. And um, one of them was, hey, move down a little bit further down the park. And the other one was morning fishing for walleye. Um, could be a little bit more difficult. You're better off going in the evening. So um, we're going to try this morning one. And then if we don't catch anything, then we're going to try an evening one. So we'll see how it goes. Again, it's 6 o'clock in the morning. The sun will be up in about an hour. And we'll have a couple hours here. Hopefully we catch something. You know, so this is what we're uh, starting with here. Green colored, pink head jig, one ounce. We'll see how it goes. We got our first fish. Good fighter. You guys are gonna have to uh, Hopefully we'll be able to pull it in. I don't have a um, I got a walleye. I got a nice one. Hopefully it doesn't break the line trying to pull it in. Here we go, guys. Look at that walleye. Can you guys see him? And we're gonna try to, there we go. Look at this guy. Look at him. Oh, what a beauty. We are gonna put him away in the ice box. And we got one. Man, I wish I could uh, give you guys a better view here. Oh, look at this guy. Heck of a fight. Love it. He's a keeper. All right. I went to go put the fish on ice. I don't have a stringer or a rope to throw the fish back in the water, so. Went back to the car. We'll measure that guy uh, when we get home. I seem to be about a three, maybe a four pounder. That's it. So I'm glad we got my first Detroit River walleye. It took how many times? Three, four times to figure this out? I wouldn't even say I figured it out either. But definitely appreciate some of the advice. Moving a little bit further down behind the post office. There we go. <laughs> so you're wondering what the temperature is there. You saw my um, face. Um, it's about 38 degrees, so it's not too bad. There's no wind. The river's pretty clear. Um, we haven't had really any significant rain in um, close to a week, so over a week. See if we can catch another one. Downtown Windsor. Look at Detroit. This is a wonderful park. So what I'm doing is I'm throwing it out about one, uh, 11 o'clock out in the stream, or in the river rather, and then waiting for it to settle to the bottom. And by the time it settles, it seems like it's the lure has moved to let's say maybe 1 o'clock, 12.30 when looking at uh, Canada and um, then you just kind of bounce it along that bottom pull it up a little bit, reel a couple times, let it fall back down rinse and repeat so over there 
you can, you can see those headlights there, right in the center of the screen. Canadians are coming in, fish their side. So hopefully they're successful. There we go. Hey everybody, so I'm switching. Uh, lost the lure, pink jig head. Uh, had a fish on and it broke the line. So that was the second fish, but I'm gonna switch over to um, a more of a blue color. Now this was um, recommended by Dawn on one of our last YouTube channel videos. And so we're gonna try it out. So we are roughly about, let's see what time it is. Not about 40 minutes in, half hour in. Sun's starting to pop out a little bit here. So looking great. Alright, we are heading home before sunrise, 7.30, fished for an hour and a half. Um, had to make it back home. So, one fish, one walleye. We got a couple people fishing now. Wind's picking up, so it's getting a little chilly. But, yeah, beautiful. Look at that sun. Just about to pop over. So with that, my first walleye from the river done.